Hey everybody, welcome to my YouTube page, The Art of Ring Smoke with Phil Jost. I'm Phil Jost, let's get started. Hey, uh, we're on scene with FDNY, we're going to let this start playing because we have a few things. Remember that when we're looking at smoke, we have to recognize that there's everywhere we see smoke, from here and from here, right, these two spaces are connected. Uh, the open doors in between them, we're going to start actually getting some fire out here, right, as it, as it starts to grow, as it has, definitely has some access to air. And uh, we have to see that there's a continuity of fuel, right? Smoke is fuel, continuity of fuel. That tells us that this base and this base are connected, right? Probably the same apartment. And FDNY stretch it up there. Uh, we're going to get this window broken out for ventilation as well in just a minute. And then we're going to see, in fact, I'm going to just pop it forward a little bit so we can get ahead of that and uh get up to the next phase right so gonna, they're gonna vent this this next window and this the fire's gonna grow uh, while they're stretching right so we have still have an early stage fire um mostly uh white smoke not very much there's a little bit of turbulence here this is mostly laminar out of this other window right this is mostly laminar right now a little bit of turbulence here and notice that when they broke this window the smoke coming out of there actually slowed down so probably a a, um, a less uh, obstruction in the path here, right? Could be they're closing some doors and stuff up there too. Not 100% not certain, but we're gonna watch this fire. Uh, while they're stretching, it's gonna grow a little bit till, till we get a pretty significant fire coming out here. And um, what we're gonna look at though is we're gonna keep our eye on this left window because once we start getting uh, an increase in velocity and density over there. It doesn't take very long. Remember, velocity is where the fire is now. Density is where the fire is on its way to. And when this thing starts smoking, which it is right now, right? But all of a sudden, we're going to see a rapid increase in velocity and density, followed by fire extension over into that space. And both windows are going to be on fire. And that's what we should anticipate. So really quickly here, really quickly it grows. And it's going to light off very, very quickly here. You can see it's already lit off inside, and now it's coming out the window. Okay, now, uh, the next phase we're going to get to see is a fire attack. And when we apply water to see the fire, uh, right, the first thing we get, right, from a reading smoke perspective, the first thing we get is a rapid, you know, massive increase in uh, billowing steam, right, which is what we're seeing here, right, that really the volume actually goes up if there's billowing instead of that underlying turbulence. We're going to see that here, and then we're going to see that here. From that point, there should be a rapid and sustained decrease in overall velocity and density, which we're not going to get over here as much until they hit this. Notice it almost stopped over here. Now there's a little bit of fire going, but I'm just going to go back and just watch that again. Right, so pretty good turbulence there. Watch when they when they hit this other part of the fire, it almost stops smoke coming out the, the window on this right hand side. Look at that. Bam. Right? And so yeah, there's a little bit of a spot fire here, curtains or something like that. Copious volumes of billowing steam, but overall the velocity and density, right? The volume change because of the addition of the steam, but the velocity and density rapid and sustained decrease in both velocity and density because the FDNY is killing it up there in that apartment, okay? So uh, when we get that water application, that's the visual that we're going to see. So if you if you have the opposite, right, if somebody says, hey, we got water on the fire, but there's still a lot of underlying turbulence and that, that velocity, right, the turbulence, the velocity, and the thickness, the density, the underlying density maintain that means you're not getting it on uh, that wa that water's not having the impact that you want because there's still a um, significant fire. In this case, that's that's not what we have. They they've killed this thing. Uh, the velocity and density from here should continue to go down over the course of time. Might take a little while. If the velocity or the density levels out or starts to go up, then you have a spot fire that you need to find and uh, put it out right. But uh, in this case. Water application has done its job, right? Certainly there's more work to do, but it's largely done its job. And so for this week with the Art of Reading Smoke with uh, Phil Jost, I'm Phil Jost. Hit like, think about subscribing, and certainly spread the word uh, to the Reading Smoke Nation about these videos for your use. I
Phil Joseph. I'm out.